I got a lot. I, I still have my hand on my to shaft. The Yeah, use that one. The only podcast in the world where we only use two notes. <laughs> yeah, use that one. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the one. That's the one. That's the one. <laughs> Number two podcast today. Yes, we are it. Oh god. I wonder who else right now in the world is recording a podcast right now. I think about that sometimes. Do you ever think really? about like when you're taking a or a, a, a poo poo? That who else in the world? How many, how many you other people can bleep that word out? You already <laughs> said it. You didn't. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I mean, caca. <laughs> I wonder. I always wonder, like, how many people are like cooming at the same yeah, time that I, I am. I think yeah. about people taking shits all day. <laughs> that's, that's all I ever think about is taking day. a dump. Mm-hmm. I do think about that though. Like sometimes I'll be walking around the neighborhood, just like, I wonder how many people in these houses are getting laid right now, or like, yeah, taking a dump, or just like it's just like it'd be cool to like see that statistic and just know it'd for be- sure. <laughs> you're just gonna say it'd be cool to see that just like you can <laughs> see your neighbor vision. every cool time that'd be, cool too. that'd be cool you just want to watch your neighbors are breathing today probably all of them that are still alive <laughs> billions, I, reckon. I would imagine yeah, billions, not very many in china billions and okay. billions <laughs> you really screwed that tetris move up just there yeah. dude. shut the fuck up dude yeah the entire time we record the podcast soup plays tetris battle royale i sure do you know why because it helps me focus because i have aids well, obviously, you're focusing more on the podcast because you got I think you're thinking of ADHD. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, dude. Go say poo poo some more, you little fucking beta bitch. Fuck okay. you. Okay. Right. Uh, <laughs> dude's testosterone is through the roof right now. Yeah, yeah do us for a run beforehand. So he's just, he's been off the chain the last few minutes. We got to put him back in yeah. his place. I'm a little more <laughs> alpha than usual. A little yeah. more alpha dude, you're than gonna get, usual. You're going to get so many, like, Random girls in your team's like, oh my god, the dude when he's alpha choke me and spit in my mouth. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I didn't like that. <sighs> I I mean, am I wrong though? Like, <laughs> no, I just don't want to hear it. You, you already know, like, have girls that like, are like obsessed okay, with but, you. But it's like hearing your parents have sex. Like, you know what happens. You don't want to hear about it though. Like, you know. Uh, yeah, gotta, but if you're, dude, there are girls who are like obsessed with dude. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Wow, I've heard stories nasty. of. Thank you for. Sharing that information, but I can't, I couldn't imagine being a girl that's obsessed with dude, and they just kind of have to accept <laughs> that he's usually kind of effeminate. And then once he starts getting like fit. what, what testosterone what filter, like, oh my god, the dude what testosterone filter. What? what makes me effeminate? Big exactly. nasty is the Please king explain. of you. Literally out wore of his a ass. skirt in a video <laughs> with a wig. So how does that make me effeminate? I did that for the. You lols. did that for millions you of views. You do a very, very, very good female voice and a good, a good lolly voice. <laughs> You're also small. Dude, You're soft. Just my genetics. I'm not I imagine soft. like I, I, I mean, nasty, say that for sure, but you look soft. Okay? Shitting on you right now. <laughs> okay, <laughs> absolutely. You feel like about. if I touched you, you'd feel like a like a naked mole rat. Like you'd feel like a God a damn very, it, nasty. Yeah, what, what did he do? Very, to you? Did no, I, this is this is a compliment. All I said like, was, all I was well, a here's compliment. What Here's what I said was I said I'm a little more alpha, and McNasty could not <laughs> let that stand. He could that not could have not. that happening. No. <laughs> You're not taking the alpha one in the group. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> God, that was just... This is the uh, <laughs> cringiest <laughs> conversation. Dude, that was, was just a... It was, more of a it was more of a compliment. I mean, some people are... Like You're a, a little fucking bitch, dude. That's a compliment, <laughs> no, dude. I didn't say that. No, I didn't say that. You're a little like, feeble beta bitch! <laughs> Literally. I feel like if you needed to fight, you could probably fight, because I feel like you're nimble and quick. <laughs> Where are you going with this, bro? I don't know. Wait, so I'm effeminate and soft, but I could kick ass if I wanted yeah, to. I meant, I meant soft as in, like, if you're I like touched a, you, you'd feel very maid. well, like, moisturized. You're like a maid that if someone <laughs> didn't like the way you cleaned the house, you could just throw the vacuum at them and run away. Uh-huh. That's the nicest thing anyone's ever could said Did you do that? Nobody has said. Nice I mean, in some cases, then. it's better to be to have. <laughs> in, in actually, in pretty much every case, it's it's better to have to be comfortable with your feminine side. You know. Uh, well, that's why I wore a skirt on Omegle. Exactly. <laughs> I don't give a shit. That's what, what I was saying. Think. It wasn't. A, it wasn't an insult. <laughs> Holy shit. It wasn't an insult. Okay. But I was saying when I called you soft. I, when I called you soft, I didn't mean like soft. Like a, you're a softy and you can't like handle pressure. You're a saltine cracker. Yummy. You're one of those things. Cracker. One word, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, I'm definitely a cracker in every sense of the word. I'm the worst. We're all crackers, except for Matt. He's a. All right, bro. <laughs> he's he's more of like a Ritz cracker. <laughs> yeah, he's a yeah. cracker. He's, he's been baked to- a little, little bit. bit toasted. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like a peanut butter cracker. <laughs> <laughs> You're like a pretzel. <laughs> oh, dude, I want uh, a mall pretzel. 
Oh, dude, <laughs> you know what's weird? Pretzel. <laughs> what makes a mall pretzel like one you find on the floor of the yeah, mall than a regular pretzel? <laughs> When you're digging through the trash in the, in the food <laughs> the one you steal from the security guard when he's not looking. <laughs> when Paul no, yeah. turns his head. Dude, Dude mall pretzels and they're like fluffy and you dip them in like the... The cheese. Yeah, the oh! cheese. I was going to mustard, but I don't like mustard with pretzels. Mm. Ooh, mustard on a pretzel sounds nice. That's like a traditional... No, that's, that's, what everyone, like, that's what like, Germans that's how everyone do. ate it. Yeah, that's yeah mm-hmm. mustard and pretzels. That and cheese. They usually... Oh, well, they don't, they don't usually use like regular like yellow mustard. It's usually like... Yellow mustard. Honey mustard or something. Yeah, it's not like a super spicy mustard, but still. Yeah, it's but I yeah I prefer like the cheese. Um, this is a good conversation. Yeah. Have you ever had like, like a cheese pretzel? Wait, or it's like a pretzel a with like the cheese. Pretzel? The cheese. You really like pretzels, it? McNasty? You yeah, eat you're pretzels going like all the time. You know what's I, weird is when I was younger, I used to f- hate pretzels, but like ever since I discovered peanut butter pretzels, where it's got like the peanut butter inside. <sighs> dude, I feel like pretzels so are like good. beer, where it's just like no kid likes them, but then as you get older, you're like, hey, you know, that's yeah. actually not. That I like when them you, as when kid, you eat like a plain, like when you eat like yeah. a plain hard pretzel, it, it's almost like you're eating like, like you're eating like a piece of burnt bread or something. Like there's not a whole lot to it. Oh, regular pretzels, yeah, those can go. Like the pretzel sticks and just like the regular. I, like little- I, I kind of like shit like that though. Like I, I like Chex Mix, and you know, like the fucking brown pieces. That people like don't usually like, and they won't eat those. Yeah, those I'm are the those ones people. that I like. Oh, interesting. Yeah, are you talking like, about like the flat bread, the bread looking yeah. ones? They're yeah, they're kind of bitter tasting. I those like are, those. Those are my favorite. Yeah, yeah, they those sell are really good. They sell Chex Mix of just those, uh, but really? I don't think it's called Chex Mix. The, the brown pieces. <laughs> it's literally it's All just browns? the rye bread. <laughs> that's a, that's a, that's a niche little, market. It's little yeah. pieces of rye bread. <laughs> <laughs> but I think it's it's not Chex Mix brand. It's a different brand. I don't know what it Chex is. Chex Mix Ebony brand. <laughs> <laughs> the, the Ebony edition of the Chex Mix. <laughs> Chex. <laughs> what? What? What were you trying to say? Josh? Where were you going? <laughs> I don't know it. I don't you were about know to it. Say a gamer word. I felt <laughs> it. <laughs> you were about to say a PewDiePie word, weren't you? Ah, uh, nah. I've grown from that. <laughs> oh, I'm glad. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> That's great to you. fucking doubt. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, All what right. happened? You just got fucked, Sue. So, Do I we, have a question. Uh, is, um, I was going to say, do we question. have any uh, topics? But yeah, alright, go ahead. This isn't really a topic. I was just okay. something I thought of. Okay. I recently discovered how much I fucking love TikTok. <laughs> yeah, I saw your tweet yesterday about that Dude, one that made you belly I was just like... Because I, I had that recent thing with that guy that was trying to like impersonate me. Yeah. yeah, and, yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. So I made my own account and then like <laughs> I'm trying to get it verified. So the manager said, hey, you need to fucking promote that shit so that you have like a following at least. And uh, yeah, I've yeah. just been on my for you page just scrolling through shit. Well, a lot of it is just like dumb. Like it won't yeah. even be funny. It'll be like, this is how you should uh, buy a house. You should get an FHA loan and blah, blah, blah. And it's oh, like, yeah. who the fuck wants to watch that? Finance talk. <laughs> Like I've finance, yeah, finance that. talk, yeah. yeah. Uh, but um, yeah, I'm okay every once in a while, I'll just find like a banger. It's something that just fucking kills me. Like there's this yeah. one TikTok of a dog that's like getting its toenails cut, and it's just screaming like a human, and it's just <laughs> it's just hilarious to me. You sound like yeah, a um, boomer that found YouTube for the first time. Like, that's, <laughs> that's what I feel like. I feel like there a face- funny videos online. I feel like a Facebook mom that found Vine like yeah. three years after it came out. <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, no, I just I, I always I always associated TikTok with how like it's soup like second channel soup videos, watches, just yeah. nothing just but cringe. cringe. And yeah, just, there's yeah, like, there's some gems in there here and there. I mean, you it's, have to it, like train your for you page. Yeah, you have yeah. to train it. Yeah. You have to skip. It's definitely all that like cringe. an algorithm. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. I haven't even really like. What's weird is I haven't really seen like any of that cringe stuff. I don't. Well, because don't you're know, not like, clicking on it. Like that's the kind of stuff that like. 15 year old girls are clicking on like it's that yeah, kind of shit true. like you're you're you know for you page won't be that because you're not clicking on it same with instagram instagram has a similar one fucking 14 year old girls are watching the shit that i watch okay well <laughs> some yeah, of the shit that i some watch some of the, some some of the stuff you watch i don't bad, think anybody's yeah. watching <laughs> <laughs> Dude, well, I'll, I'll look at uh some of the views or like likes and people will find those like cringy ass weird videos and it'll have like two likes or like four likes. Yeah, that's, yeah. I don't, I don't so know. So how they find are you that. even fucking finding that? I feel Somebody like it's those them. people's job to just like. Is there like a way on TikTok you can sort by like new uploads or something? Maybe or bad, yeah. <laughs> bad or videos. Or just like most recent videos ever posted. Is that probably sort by cringe? Yeah, <laughs> just like a cringe category. Is this video shit. <laughs> <laughs> 
um but yeah I mean, do you guys do you guys do tiktok at all or no i do no nah, my like my girlfriend sends me once once in a while yeah it's funny because you're the like most it. active tiktok user but you don't use tiktok itself <laughs> yeah <laughs> you've seen the most tiktoks oh wait who's soup or me soup oh <laughs> what were you gonna say dude oh well, like, i just yeah, i'm on the <laughs> <laughs> well because that applied to me too because i use it to to like at least see what what like new songs or people are like into and shit because there's a oh, lot of sh- that makes sense, stuff that yeah. I'll play on there that that people really like on Omega and whatever. So, but I I I've never uploaded or tried to make a single TikTok. So I thought maybe you were talking to me, but Soup's definitely more. Well, I used to have content a TikTok, creation, but I got banned because I do? did a TikTok of me putting a gun in my mouth and they didn't. Oh, that'll that. do it. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't think any Not platform good. will allow that one. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I love that weasel <laughs> when you know you did something fucking stupid. Yeah. Like if guilty dogs had a laugh, like when they tore a pillow up, it would be that. <laughs> it's my favorite. Do uh, how come you never tried to like post like guitar stuff on TikTok? Um. Yeah, that should probably blow up. Procrastination, like, so just good. not getting around to it, being a retard. That's really mm. the only reason. Because people mm. post my stuff on there. Like you said, you have Same. impersonators. Were they posting like your clips, or what were they doing? So exactly? basically, what was happening with that guy is he. Um, I I went back and looked at like, because he was he was just strictly posting clips from like my my all of my channels, and uh-huh. uh, I went back and like maybe a few months ago he like the captions would just be like hashtag McNasty hashtag McNasty official hashtag for you page like stuff that was making it seem like it was a fan account and then like out of the blue he started putting the caption as um I bet you 100 emoji that you can't find my channel and sub to it and then the link in his uh, bio was his channel and damn. yeah that I um love it see I, I thought that I thought that they were asking for money or something I thought that's what you had told me no, he was just, he was using, he was using the growth that he got from my stuff to promote his, his Fortnite channel, which is kind of funny because I, I, most of, if not all of my viewers know that I fucking hate that game. So it's like, mm-hmm. <laughs> like if I had done yeah, what I did a with a bad like, YouTuber to yeah. promote Fortnite. Exactly. Yeah. yeah if I had done what like I did with creamy or something, he'd probably be yeah. right. If I had done drunk. what I did with like the Ainsley stuff and just started uploading like Roblox uh boring moments or something like you have to, like if you're boring, if you're gonna, <laughs> boring that's moments. a title God, i can't wait to click on that <laughs> like the thing, if you're gonna grow from like a content creator that does a certain game you can't just play a completely opposite game and expect growth it's just like <laughs> it's just i don't know it's just dumb to me but like the fuck thing is Soup. is that i he contacted me in uh instagram dms and he was like he was like dude i'm so sorry like i told you i was sorry and like you know, I'll, I'm going to remove my, my, uh, I'm going to remove my, my link off of all the shit. And he did for a day. And I told him, I was like, if you want to like, be cool, like put, like promote me, like put, if you're going to do anything, put my link in the thing, because it's, you know, people come to your page for my content. So put my mm-hmm. fucking link in the bio. And he's like, okay. And he did for a day. And then he told mm-hmm. me, he's like, uh, he's like, yeah, I just, I'm just going to private the page. I don't, I don't even want to deal with it anymore. And then I found out the next day that he, his idea of privating the page was um, blocking my TikTok account. So that I, from my point of view, it seems like he, he privated, but he didn't. And, and then, then he put just his link back in. He put his link uh, back in and did that and uploaded the same video. Yeah, the same what a fucking yeah. scumbag. Dude, why can't everyone just that does that be like Sam Poppy Rick? Why can't we just have that? I don't give yeah. a fuck if people yeah. post our content like anywhere. And you know, I even like promote your stuff on the side, but like at least say like, hey, this isn't my content. Yep. Um, oh no! But, yeah, he know. was completely pretending to be, like he was replying to people in the comments. Like, yeah, no, that's like, what I people mean. People were like, "I bet, I bet me nasty couldn't reply to this," and he'd be like, "Hey, and yeah, be like, that's fucking age. yeah, that's fucking weird." Also, it, it should be like fucking Darwinism, where if you're dumb enough to fall for it, then like too fucking bad. But yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure I can say this for all of us that we'll never ask for fucking money through TikTok. So <laughs> if anybody, yeah, it, 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 yeah, well, yeah. I, I mean, but like, yeah. Didn't well, you have something like that, Soup? I, I, I feel can't like I remember, remember hearing I'm, about that or something. I, I might have been thinking about myself when I said that because I don't know if I if I had that happen to me or not. Were you just like asked or Vanos Gaming asked you for money or something? 
with like three <laughs> followers on <laughs> like Twitch or some shit. No, I think somebody was. Imp- I, I don't know if it was me or someone else, but somebody was impersonating somebody and asking for money or something. Yeah, so. I, f- I feel like a good rule of thumb is like if there's not a link to that social platform on like our YouTube or like any of other social media, then like it's not us and it's just someone. Yeah, else well, just don't yeah. send fucking money to us unless it's like through Twitch or something like that. Like that's yeah. the yep, only. That's viable the only way. way to do it. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Unless yeah. we're streaming on Twitch and it's our actual Twitch account, then which we're all you verified not be on there anyway. So. Yeah, and ninety nine point nine percent, if not a hundred percent, we don't ask for money. We don't. Right. Really, yeah. We're very well <laughs> off. We I don't, don't think, yeah. I don't think yeah. any of us have asked for money. <laughs> yeah, if anyone's right. asking for money under us, then that is just dumb. Do not yeah. fall for <laughs> that. If, you, yeah. if you come across a channel that has my clips on it called the Do Covers and there's a Cash App link, that's not me. Does somebody <laughs> actually have that? That channel got nuked, the one that was oh, asking for money. But, that's good, um, that's good. Yeah, no, that might have been you I was thinking about. Then. Oh, maybe it was. Then. Uh, yeah, because yeah. yeah. that, that biggest channel that was just posting my Omega stuff, he was actually pretending to be me and doing, like, polls as me. Um, and, so like, what should my stupid. next video be? Like, he had like he's controlling my content somehow or something. Dude. And then he and then he had um place in, in description and, like, in the channel you are, like, the, the banner, where, like, cash app me. It's like, really, bitch? Bro, out of anyone in the world that person could have impersonated, they chose the do. That's what I don't understand, is these people choose YouTubers to impersonate. <laughs> well, people fall for like, it, is the thing, dude. People do it's fall like, for it, yeah. It's like scam phone calls, dude. People it's, fall for that dumb shit. Because that is just, a channel that would make sense for me to make, to be honest. Yeah, so. I guess, but it's just, I don't know, it's... You need to make that channel, wow. so, like, that's the thing, yeah. it's like, when, I, when I've experienced the impersonation on TikTok, my first initial thought was, I need to make a TikTok for myself. And yeah. so I don't have to deal with this shit anymore because it's just going to keep happening again if I just yeah. if I don't make like a verified one. No, absolutely. Yeah, I have the same thing <clears throat> on TikTok. There's some like really established channels that are like the do TikTok and whatever, and and they have yeah. like two hundred thousand followers. So, well, I, I mean, like, uh, it's totally cool if like you're doing it as a fan. Like, I, I think there, they are. I don't there's think another there's bad account, intentions there. There's another account on TikTok that kind of has a little bit of a following, and they post my clips, but like in their bio, they in caps lock it says. This is not the real McNasty. This is a fan account. And I'm like completely okay with that. Yeah, yeah that's totally fine. I'm like pretending yeah. to be me. That's just fucking. In fact, I encourage weird. that. Yeah, I encourage no, that. Awesome. If yeah, anybody wants to do good. that, fan account, yeah. Make yeah, all the fan accounts. <laughs> I was going to say, I yeah. don't want to go on that hellhole. So if somebody else wants to go post our clips, yeah, feel free. If people want to put, yeah, and promote <laughs> yeah. our shit, hey, you're yeah. saving us a lot of fucking work and headache. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I would pay lots of money to stay away from that hellhole app. I hate it. It's, it's honestly not bad. I. That's no, that's the mentality I always had it. with it. I always thought like, God, this is just like a fucking cringe fest full of like dancing kids. But I've been on it. and I've seen like one person dancing, and it was like a big fat mom. It wasn't even a kid. It was just like <laughs> a. Okay, well, I I've been on there a long time. I've never seen fat moms dancing. So <laughs> your for you page being trained a little bit differently. Well, my yeah. for you page, I've only liked like two TikToks, so my for you page is just like fresh random shit. You know, just all uh, random it's like bullshit. untrained. It's like starting a brand new YouTube account. Yeah. It's like a public restroom. <laughs> Fresh random yes. shit. <laughs> <laughs> yes, TikTok is a public restroom. Good analogy, Basically. <laughs> Man. Oh, God. The world. I remember I when, when TikTok first came out, I like <laughs> I was gonna make one, and the reason I didn't is because that whole thing was happening like with China and like we were just gonna nuke TikTok. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're just gonna nuke China. <laughs> hey, that app's annoying. We're gonna nuke the whole country. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah that's, that's why I ended up not making one. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> <laughs> right, do we have any America. topics? Um, I don't know. Twenty-two minutes in. I haven't really been paying attention to anything other than talk talk. Talk talk. My favorite uh, platform. I mean, talk, we can, talk. Somebody sent us another another email. Another of email. Questions. Open that bitch up, motherfucker! Woo! All right. Putting a pit. What is? I don't uh, want to get you all like gangstered out. <laughs> or you okay, Super? It's on. Gonna, <laughs> Tetris Battle Royale got you fucking tweaking over I'm in a over. good mood, dude. I'm glad. Yeah. I feel like Soup has a lot of good days. I feel like one in every four times I talk to you, you're just. <laughs> so excited to tell us about your good mood, and that just it makes me so happy. Thank you, Blarge.com. No problem. Uh, liquidmetal.gov. <laughs> nice URL. 
Dude, can you stop shitting on me? What did I do to you? You know what's funny? Oh, how does it feel? <laughs> I remember. How does it feel? I never shit on you. Well, you dude, never shit dude. on me. Okay. Dude got his ass stretched by McNasty, so, you know, he's just a little just, Yeah, now. McNasty just ripped into you, and you fucking... And yeah, McNasty okay. spent like five minutes going on. Yeah, he just was kept that, going. Was that on the podcast? That was... It, that was it was wasn't like was that on the podcast? That was just five minutes ago. <laughs> yeah. I'm really in a different that dimension. What the podcast <laughs> mean? <laughs> are we Dude, the podcast are right now. RuneScape does not take that much fucking brain power. <laughs> was, was that, that today? on the podcast? <laughs> yeah. Oh, are you fucking good? Yeah, what is going on? What My planet name, are you on? Mm, 47. My name... 47. Mm, my name... Mm, 47. Okay, good name. <laughs> Do any of you wish to procreate in the future? If so, what, what is something you Fuck wish to impart no, on them? Are you, wait, so that you wished, oh, oh, your parents imparted on you when you wait, were younger. Are you reading a topic? Yes. Are you just saying, do we want to have kids? I there Yeah, are, you want to have kids? Mm -hmm. No. Nope. Yeah, eventually. I do. I hate kids so much. Yeah, same. Just despise You guys don't want to have kids. No. How does, just, your, how does your girlfriend feel about that, Matt? Uh, she doesn't she want kids either. Oh god! So, I wish I could find somebody like that. Jesus Christ! Dude, for the price it's so of hard raising, to find women like, that don't want kids. For the price of raising like multiple kids, you could just go get like a house in the south of France and. <laughs> well, most people there. don't see kids as a price thing. <laughs> they are a price thing. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean what they are, like, but that's not why people have kids. It's a hundred k to raise a kid from like birth to eighteen or something like that. It's probably well, like, even more minimum. than minimum. It's, it's like, like quarter of a million. Ads. You yeah, know what, Blar? Like, you're gonna hate me for this, but I hope you accidentally have a kid. <laughs> well, that would need a lot of things to go very wrong, so <laughs> I'm, we're okay. Okay. Yeah, why don't you tell your kid that someday? Well, a lot of things went wrong, and here you are. <laughs> you were yeah. a lot of things going wrong, little buddy. That's on a podcast yeah, that's going to be posted shit. on the internet. Yeah, yeah I'm sending this to your kid on their Hey, hey future kid, if you're accidentally here, yeah, you, you were a complete mistake. Didn't want you at all. <laughs> probably still don't. <laughs> you're probably just a burden, but you know, that's fine. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. Oh God. God. What the fuck, man? You guys don't want kids? <laughs> no. I don't, I don't I, have a few kids. No dude, more every than, like, time three, I see though. a kid, I just want to punch it in the head. Like, what Me are you too. doing? What that's because you got to raise good it's kids, not, dude. It's not paying raise. rent. It's not doing nothing. It's just sitting there and shitting in his diaper. Go get a job. You were doing That's that a baby. Time. There's a difference. <laughs> no, go You're going to be a, a perfectly good kid, like a normal kid that doesn't really have any issues, and then he'll stand up and start like doing Fortnite dances. And then I just want to punch him in the back of the head. Oh yeah, well, see, that's why head. you that's why you raise your kid that when they do a Fortnite dance, you, <laughs> you get the belt, belt and beat them <laughs> every right. inch of their life. <laughs> that's right. That's right. <laughs> and then see you if they ever prison. floss again. You can floss with Daddy's belt, bitch. You better be flossing with Jesus. You keep on, yeah. bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck! <laughs> flossing with Jesus. <laughs> Kids who floss don't go to heaven. Flossing <laughs> with Jesus has got to be the funniest fucking sentence I have Jesus. ever heard. Can we get that put on a shirt? Can we make a merch that just says flossing oh, with like Jesus? Like a dead kid on it? What would you have on the shirt? <laughs> just says skull and crossbones. Uh, flossing with Jesus. Just a very small casket. <laughs> oh, God. That's so <laughs> Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what was the topic? I'm just saying. Do you want to have oh, right, kids? That's right, right. Yeah, okay, and, yeah. and the other part was hey, what would you want to teach them, which we just covered. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so. Do we have dementia today? We're like forgetting everything. Hey. I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> what is dementia? I okay. forgot. I get it. Uh, he's doing a bit. <laughs> <laughs> That's good Apparently point. we all have Alzheimer's in our brain and it's just your lifestyle slows it down or lets it happen faster. What? Wow, all I right. didn't give a shit. Yeah, you suck, I heard, man. I heard a doctor talk about that the other day and that was very depressing. Imagine just waking up and forgetting you have Alzheimer's and just being cured. It's that easy. <laughs> Why don't all people just do that? <laughs> why don't you just remember? <laughs> yeah, you, dude, just stop forgetting. What are you doing? Stop getting sick. Just forget that you are sick. Dumbass. I think exactly. when you have, like, Alzheimer's is really like a hereditary thing, too. If it happens yeah. a lot in your family, it'll, it'll it happen. It can be you. genetically predisposed, yeah. That'd be so fucked. Why don't they just call get... it old timers? Because I mean, that would be stupid. What it is, really? <laughs> old timers. I reckon it's some <laughs> dude's name that forgot stuff. That's why they named it that. Do you think that he forgot that he forgot about stuff? 
what? <laughs> you need a roadmap for that one. <laughs> Here's a good question. Uh, uh, what are what are okay. some fucked things you guys did as kids or teens with your friends? Um, fucked things like some sus stuff. Well, I, I didn't. It wasn't sus, but I don't know. I was like a I was a dick one day for no reason. To this day, I still don't know why. But I had one of my friends over, and it was my birthday recently, and like we had a pinata. And so I had, like, the pinata bat and stuff. And we were going through all my toys. And he's like, can I play with this? And I was like, no. And then, like, everything he'd pick up, I'd say no to him playing with it. And he just kept asking me and annoyed me. So I just said, you can play with this. And I hit him in the face with the pinata bat. And I have no idea why I did that. Oh, my God. Yeah, Jesus. His, his, nose, his it, nose was bleeding like crazy. And my mom made me sit in the laundry room for, like, two hours. <laughs> laundry room. <laughs> I, I, to what did this you do day, in the laundry room? I, Separate I, the whites. I don't really remember that. Excuse me. It's not what you do in laundry. <laughs> laundry. <laughs> laundry jokes. Laundry discrimination. <laughs> laundry is is doing white supremacy. Cancel. Uh, I can we cancel laundry? <laughs> Everyone <laughs> smell like <laughs> shit. Yeah, the, a lot the of dirty and whites. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's, well, yeah, that's that's I don't know, that's probably the worst thing I could think of that I did, and I was like, why? Um, the only thing I uh, I ever really did I feel like was you like, did more fuck shit in your adult life, like shit on a school. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, for sure. Cool. Well, because you do shit when you're drunk, and it's just like that's when you're not even yourself. Imagine if kids could just get drunk, the shit they would do. Um, the only thing, I can't I don't know, I can't really remember. Shit on the floor. I never like hurt animals. I've always been an animal lover. Like I know some yeah. kids like like to fuck with animals. Um. Yeah, serial killers. Oh my! The yeah. other day, my cousin told me that he used to. Uh, <laughs> so my cousin, my cousin's like me. He's a huge fan of frogs. Love frogs. <laughs> huge fan of frogs. Huge fan of frogs. Frog. Frog. Big frog guy. Who has, who has ever frogs. said that? Unironically, <laughs> on a fucking t-shirt. He's a fan of frogs. That guy and yes. frogs. Tight. Tight. <laughs> <laughs> that's so, uh, so fucking lame. Name a better duo. Dude, I'll frogs are so wait. cool. What do you mean? That, dude, that frogs sounds like best. something you would describe someone as. It has like no personality. <laughs> <laughs> he likes frogs. I don't uh, know. That's fucking Number frog one guy fa- again. Frog fan. That's like his biggest personality trait is just into frogs. That's such a shit personality trait. <laughs> I mean, like maybe if he was like Steve Irwin, that would be a cool fact. Or maybe but, if he you had know. Downs, like just <laughs> that's, that's such a lame. Dude, frogs are so cool. What do you mean? <laughs> they just fucking hop around, ribbit, and eat flies. What is yeah, that? Yeah, no, cool? that's why they're cool. They look funny, and they just—they <laughs> do look funny. They make—I don't know—they just look funny. <laughs> Those look like they're like angry and sad at the same time. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> Cousin, huge frog dude. When he was young, <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry, I can't. I can't. <laughs> I've just never known anybody who's into frogs. <laughs> Most of it's like, oh, there's a Wait, frog. Is All he right. actually like this into frogs, or are you just saying this like he's into the frogs? Story up? Well, I don't know if he is now, but when he was a kid, he was super into frogs. Oh fuck! Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, did the passion die? That's actually really sad. Uh, did the fire burn out? <laughs> yeah. Did okay. the ribbit ribbit away? He ribbit his last ribbit. All right, I'm composed now. I'm sorry. This frog passion croaked. <laughs> <laughs> Go on with your right. frog friend. So when he was a kid, he had these like friends, and I, I think there was like a a crawl space under his old house, and there used to be frogs that would just like burrow their way in there, you and he'd always there. go in like take him out and like put him in a bucket and kind of like release him out in the wild so they wouldn't like, get stuck under the house. Holy shit, he had a frog <clears throat> bucket? No <laughs> way. <laughs> this is like a probably a five gallon bucket, like a Home Depot bucket. That's a lot <laughs> of frog bucket. Just a bucket specifically for frogs. Dude, you should fill that with frogs and just jump in it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay, this so. Is, this is my favorite conversation. He, he, there was like these three, two or three kids he did it with, right? And he, uh, Excuse me. He <laughs> <laughs> did the fire and stuff with Christ. <laughs> this guy is obsessed with little kids and frogs, huh? What a guy! <laughs> Holy fuck! <laughs> oh, I'm crying. <laughs> okay, go ahead. <laughs> okay, so he, he had these friends that he would get the frogs with, right? Put them in the bucket, and like they released them in the wild. But he said like one day he went out there, and they had already gotten the frogs. And they were just like throwing frogs up in the air 
and just like they would watch him land and just like explode on the ground and then he <laughs> would like the they would take him and just full frog? force like throw a, flo- a frog at the ground just, <laughs> like, like boom, just spiking explode. it like a football and he, he used to make him like so sad I, I can't remember why I even started this conversation <laughs> we've just been laughing about <laughs> frog guy Weird, for a bad while. things that are that we did as kids I guess oh that's what I was thinking of like that's those are the kind of kids to where I think of like that's like super bad things yeah, to do that's, to that's, kind of that's pretty up. freaking cruel yeah, 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 that's pretty awful the, it, like torturing fucking animals, yeah. And like I I don't think I've ever like been like that. Maybe like I think the worst thing I ever did was put a bee in the microwave. <laughs> uh I think I talked about this on the podcast. Yeah, you did. That just but yeah, it didn't like do that. anything. It just like it was walking around all of a sudden it just stopped walking and it was just, it was just dead. It didn't like explode. <laughs> well, I tortured my cat, but like I, that yeah. was before I, I knew that it was like a bad. Like, yeah. Well, if you're doing something like, at the I, I age of two, it's like you can't. Yeah. You know, that's like I was right. super, super young. Like I don't even think I was in school, so I didn't realize like <laughs> that I'm hurting an animal. You know what yeah. I mean? I was just like, ah, so cat. Mm-hmm. I, I imagine that's how you sounded too. Yeah, that's pretty similar. <laughs> Little two year old soup just <laughs> cat. You have like a super deep voice too. Yep, that's what it was. About that, but after that, yeah, I never fucked with animals anymore. Yeah, that's, that's yeah. probably a good thing. Mm-hmm. Only with humans. Yeah, now I only that's... take small babies and throw them around my yard. <laughs> yeah, I only put kids in the microwave. Honestly, now. I would feel less <laughs> less sad for a small baby. A, a than baby in a microwave? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? How we can watch like a war movie and like we don't give a fuck. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like hundreds of people are dying, but then as soon as a, an animal dies, everyone's like, ah! "Yeah, like, ah! like saving the- Private Ryan with like legs like blown off." Blown it's like, off yeah, whatever. You chips. step on your dog's toe, and you're like, "Oh, oh!" Yeah, <laughs> literally. Dude, the ending of fucking uh, I Am Legend when his dog dies. Oh, oh dude, that's that's yeah, that's sad. Spoiler, oh, spoiler alert. I haven't seen that. Okay, that if you haven't seen I Am Legend by now, like- you need to fucking yeah. Yeah, that, uh, that has been out for a <laughs> minute. Like 2008. Yeah, literally. <laughs> there are 12 year olds who have seen that movie, so if you haven't seen it yet, <laughs> you need to fucking get on that shit. Oh. Worthless swine. Alright, hey. next topic! Um, um, what's your you favorite movie? <laughs> no huh? one answered that stupid question. <laughs> <laughs> It's funny because there's really what good questions on here, then there's just like. Asses. Then you're just like, what's your favorite movie? What's your favorite color? <laughs> what's your favorite color? Actually, that's a good question. I don't think I've ever My actually answered it. Oh, no, we went over that. Blue. We went over Dude, it, and, and, and you, you, like green and you judge you, yeah. people's favorite colors yeah, as you would. Because yeah. they're not red or blue. <laughs> or white. I actually like green when it comes to certain <laughs> things, but like. <laughs> I, I, took a, I took a sip as you said that. <laughs> you took a dip? Yeah, I took oh, a dip. Sip. A yeah. sip. No, I started a dip now. Oh, fuck. I packed a fat lip right before he said that. God damn it. Oh. Yeah, oh, don't tell Jolton really I pack a lip. <laughs> I hate it here. Yeah, green, green, good color. I like green, but on the only like certain occasions. I love... For some reason, I love green guitars. I really don't give a shit this is like, a at all. But wearing green... <laughs> This is a like shit wearing, topic. I don't know. Wearing green just makes me feel like a, like a little a leprechaun, like a like a gamer razor fan kid. I don't know. What? I, I never, never knew what, a color could invoke such. Emotion. Like whenever I think of green, I, for some reason I think of razor. Like that's just been like the thing well, forever. Yeah, that's their. Well, that's good that's marketing. Their color. Yeah. yeah, that's actually incredible. They're literally marketing. marketing a fucking color. Yeah, good yeah. Form. it's pretty impressive. But it's mostly like what it has to do with like lighting. Like if I have a green keyboard, even if it's not a razor, it's a razor. That's just the way it is. That's pretty impressive on their part. Yeah. Anyway. That's just the way it is. Um would you guys um, ever consider doing a song together like Dude did with Gibson and Marcus? Sure. Pro- pro- probably, yeah. Consider we all, probably we all never gonna do because we're lazy. Yeah, it depends on like what we did. Yeah, I'd, I'd probably be we all have stuff we could contribute. Music yeah. time! <clears throat> we make music in our videos, though. That's, I just yeah. We do well, improv. Yeah. We do. It's I mean, it's not very professional. It's one yeah, instrument and then yeah. singing. And it is very yeah, hit or miss a, when we do it's it. It's a distant piano. <laughs> That's how they did it in the old country days. What is no? your guys' favorite uh, song that we've ever done in a video? Definitely Mine is the Seven Eleven Musical. Yeah. Seven Eleven Musical. Yeah, yeah, that's absolutely. by far the best. That was so fun. Yeah, it was... Uh, 
That was a good one. <laughs> that clip also was everywhere on TikTok yep. too. Yeah, you can so. think as much as you shit on TikTok too. Like you, I gotta, I gotta thank TikTok for like that one clip of "Would you guys be there for me if I was going through something?" No, absolutely yeah. not. That clip has gone viral on TikTok like said seventy four times. Me and McNasty were talking about this the other day. <clears throat> Fucking uh, the one clip of Grizzy like soup. Do your parents know about your outro song? Oh yeah, dude, that has been reposted and still gets reposted to this mm-hmm. day. So fucking much that, that I literally, it was in like 144p subtitled in <laughs> I Arabic. I love that. <laughs> subtitled in Arabic. Oh, that's great, or dude. It, it was, it, I think it was Arabic, and it was just like 144p and zoomed in. So the Arabic it's was been... already like cut off. So <laughs> it had I, been reposted. I love like, that. <laughs> it's been screen capped so many that's times the that the quality thing. is just shit. The bit rate is just fucked. <laughs> Same with the, uh, if I pull hard enough that fucking clip, yeah. it, uh. the amount of times that, per- that clip has been like repurposed and like re-uploaded, every time I get tagged in it now, it's literally like nine pixels. Like you can count yeah, the pixels like- on screen. <laughs> <laughs> just white noise with some distant siege. Like it's the just... audio, even the audio is just completely <laughs> fucking ruined. It's so weird because like I don't understand like what the process is that makes it that bad. Because like, if screen you screen recap it, if you, like, yeah, if you it. screen record something, it's still like iPhones. Well, I guess that they're screen recording on. Yeah, like, it's the getting screen recorded and downloaded, and then screen recorded yeah. and downloaded. It's just yeah. like, like hundreds of times fucked. Yeah. Compressed and compressed. And it's compressed the funniest and, thing is the ones that have the most views and stuff are always the fucked ones. Like, why is it never the ones that are completely clear? Yeah. <laughs> or the um, ones on our channels. Yeah. <laughs> that, yeah. I think I think that video on my channel is like 300k views. Like nothing insane right. on TikTok. It's like oh, 35 like million. million. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's well, better than this? And no credit given. <laughs> It, yeah, yeah, I feel like those like clips have gone around enough where everyone's like, bro, give credit. Like, everyone knows he yeah. made those by now. I'll just like, whenever I scroll through my Instagram <laughs> notifications, I, it seems every single time I'll see at least one of somebody commenting on a video says, give credit to the dude. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and, yeah. I'm just like, and I'll go and watch it. I'm not even in the clip. Yeah, <laughs> yeah keep doing that, guys. The Spam worst. the videos that you see with us in it with that shit. Yes. I get tagged in the clip he was credit. talking about all the time, and I'm not in it. The fucking, would you be there for me if I was going, like, mm-hmm. I'm not in that. And I get tagged yeah, almost every day. Like, mm-hmm. every morning I wake up and see a notification about Instagram yeah. and that bullshit. It's so funny that they took that video and put it over, like, a, something else. Like a GTA, GTA race. yeah. And then there the was GTA another one. GTA racing I see all the time. And, like, yeah. Minecraft, like, parkour videos and stuff. Mm-hmm. I see those a lot. There was the another one, one that was... The texting was so yeah. fucking oh, weird. Oh, that was so mm-hmm. Like, the horoscope oh, yeah, yeah, one. Yeah. <laughs> uh-huh. yeah. I... God, that was awful. That was, there's, some, there's some bad ones. I get what they're getting at though, because it's like a relatable clip, and like, oh yeah, I could uh, see our friends like doing this in the group chat, but it's still, it's just weird. Range. Yeah, fuck yeah. off, idiot. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> well, I mean, it's God it's pretty, fucking damn it! It's mildly creative instead of a, just like throwing it over GTA or something. They'll think yeah, that's true. true. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah, at yeah. least they had to put like you know five minutes of effort in and not just throw it over a different like MP4. So I'll give them that, but yeah, that's pretty much what TikTok is—is is just throwing sounds over your own video yeah like I, when i was when i was on it the other day a lot of the like most popular tiktoks it would be like somebody like belting out a song and then i would think they're actually singing but then i would go and look at the audio and it's somebody else was singing and i'm just like mm-hmm. oh it's weird that like you know they're benefiting off somebody else's work but that's pretty much what fucking tiktok is it's just i like <laughs> the opposite of that have you seen that where it's like Somebody will take the video of the people singing, but we'll put different audio over it. And some dude was doing like Mario sound effects about this dude singing about missing oh, his girlfriend. Mm. I've seen, <laughs> it's so I've seen, funny. Uh, oh, I've, I've seen, seen those, but they'll, they'll make like, it'll be like a guy just like playing guitar and singing his heart out. But then they'll put like video over of, of like him singing terribly and the guitar is all fucking out of tune. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it'll just look like he's doing like a terrible job. I saw something on Instagram that was like a guy posted a guitar video. And it was something like, oh, it's so easy. And he was just playing open strings, like just picking open strings. But it was like playing something so intricate. Like and a sweep every, arpeggio yeah, up and down and the every, neck Yeah, and, and everyone was like, this is so fake. It's not even funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, the YouTuber uh, TVT uh, does videos like that. Where it's like a fakest, like guitar. Like oh, fake watching guitars. fake guitar. Yeah. 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 Oh, like that's actually out. a good idea. I feel like that'd be nope. some good content. Yeah, mm-hmm. he'll like he'll watch like somebody will send him a video of like a it'll be like a Romanian like 
news channel and there'll be like a band on there and like the guitar like like guitar guy playing guitar it's not even plugged in and he's just like holding like a g note but there's like a solo going on and he's just like (laughs) he's like pointing out like the the fake tree and stuff just vibrato like music videos in the fucking 90s because like I, I guess the editors of those music videos didn't know like how a drum set would work because you'll watch old music videos oh, and they'll be like doing some insane drum fill, but in the video they're just like hitting a cymbal one. Time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Totally yeah. <laughs> it's 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 definitely a lot easier to cover up like uh, an unsynced guitar than it is a fucking drum set because you got a big old drum set and the dude's all moving his arms and shit. Mm-hmm. The guitar is just standing there, just moving his fingers. Yeah, I don't know. When I was doing that, I was flailing my arms around. You guys couldn't see that, but yeah. I felt it though. Yeah, yeah I felt that. I felt. Did. I felt the passion there. The power. <laughs> passion of the drummer. Guns <laughs> podcast. Is that? Can you not just have like point five? Do you? Does your brain yell when it's quiet? Dude, I have. You just need to constantly. I think that I genuinely like, still have ADHD from when I was a kid. I don't think I ever got over it. Got over it. Is that a, you just, <laughs> just get, over, get over, over. Just get over your depression. Just get well, over your ADHD. A lot of the time, kids are kids are diagnosed with ADHD or ADD when they they don't actually have that. They're just like very <laughs> active. What? They don't actually have <laughs> that. What they just, just happened. Very actively <laughs> minded lost. kids. Oh yeah, he's still <laughs> playing fucking Tetris. Oh, Shut right. up. Yeah, he's, he's doing out, very poorly. I closed out of <laughs> Discord, so I didn't know what was going on. You guys are toxic. You have not improved at all. You haven't. You're horrible. <laughs> uh, what were we talking about? Wow, uh, we were talking about ADHD. Oh yeah, a lot of the time kids will be <laughs> diagnosed know. with those kind of things, and they won't actually have it. They're just like active-minded, very creative. Yeah, kids. there's hyper people. Yeah, and then they get yeah. put, put on fucking drugs and turned yeah. into little uh, corporate drones. Exactto mundo. Fuck the government. Fuck the government. Oh, Fuck it. Today. Correct. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Just now, like, I'll just be downstairs pouring myself a bowl of cereal and just read out and be here and not rule. I've been oh, married a long time ago. I imagine that. Yeah, I that believe you're that. sitting around singing all day. I am constantly making noise, and I just I don't. God, I don't know how you. I used to roommate. always like tap my my hand like a like a drum beat. Oh, I still do that. Well, I mean, I still do that too. But like, I would always do like this one particular like thing. I don't know. I'd always be like. Mm. Right. <laughs> my favorite beat <laughs> were you one of those like pen tap kids oh the pen yes. tap kids yes <laughs> like with their little fucking pens I'm like shut yeah. the fuck up oh it yes. was so and, dude was teachers de- used I, to I just definitely did that yeet those kids out in the hall all the time yeah they're pretty <clears> obnoxious really none of my teachers ever gave a fuck you could just be having a drum solo and they would just completely ignore it <laughs> bring a <laughs> drum kit to class <laughs> okay if there's a full on drum kit they might say something <laughs> Just they just apologize while over interrupting the, the drum, drum kit. <laughs> so, sorry, go ahead, sorry. Ah, uh, yes, Canadian school. They said sorry. I want to hear, like, time, when, in Canada, do you do you encounter a lot of people that have really strong Canadian accents? Uh, not where I live, no, because, like, <laughs> well, because you Why gotta realize, like, my whole... In Canada, do you encounter people with a Canadian accent? Well, he literally just said not all the time, so... Well, honestly, That's... no. Like, what? even, like... All That's of, a dumb fucking question, though. All of Southern Ontario pretty much sounds American. Like, there's certain but you don't words. sound American. Uh, I sound, yeah. like, somewhat in between. There's a couple of words that make you sound Canadian, but... Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's more like so, house. like, the, yeah, the or way... Yeah. Like, yeah. About. Like, <laughs> yeah, just certain words like that come across, like, Canadian, but... Uh, but nice there are, like, people general. out there who are just, like, full-on... Yeah, like those, are like, are just those are like full on northern Canadians that you just even I don't know what the fuck they're saying. It's just noises. <laughs> um, but yeah, those because are... I like grew up watching American news because, you know, literally being 10 minutes from America, yeah, um, I got all their news stations up. So I feel like you it's harder to develop a full Canadian accent when you just get so much American media. But mm-hmm. yeah, I don't know. I don't know anyone with like a crazy thick Canadian accent like none of my friends do or anything. Is there any like? Is there anything in Canada like? I don't know. No. How to ask this. I don't know how. To ask this. <laughs> no, it's it's just a barren wasteland. <laughs> um, is there anything in Canada? What am I trying to? What am I trying to no. say? No, we answered that. <laughs> uh, is there anything? 
Yeah, you singing didn't change <laughs> the answer. <laughs> is, okay, so you yeah, you've obviously been to America a lot. Yes. Is many, there is many, there many, anything many in Canada that's just like very obviously different than the U.S. other than the lack of like school shooters and whatnot? No, honestly, no. Like if you're just driving down, I mean, it, I guess it depends on the city. Like for the most part, um, Canadian cities overall, I notice are much cleaner than a lot of big U.S. cities. Which could uh-huh. be because of population, could be because, I don't know, whatever the fuck it is. Um, but, like, if you're just driving down, like, a Canadian highway versus an American highway, it's really not, like, insanely different. Like, you'll notice it, like, obviously because miles per hour and, you know, kilometers per hour, the street signs are all different and shit like that. But, like, I don't know. They they look pretty damn similar in a lot of places, especially when you get to big cities. They're very, very similar, but I don't know. What about, like, food? So, like, uh, any, like... I feel like it depends. Again, it all depends where. Like, I feel Toronto, like this is like a, a child asking a Canadian, like they've met a Canadian for the first well, time. But there's like, a lot of people don't actually really know anything about Canada. Like a lot of Southern U.S. thinks all of Canada is snowing twenty four seven and doesn't realize that. Like, night <laughs> doesn't realize that we get like a hundred <laughs> fucking degrees here as well. So, um, yeah, I don't know. It depends on the city. Like Toronto has pretty much every variation of food and cultural food possible it's pretty damn nice but i don't know yeah there's nothing insanely different about them at like face value so i don't know Mm. big city still big city still got crackheads still got you know crime still have all that shit so all the good stuff baby (laughs) you you ever eat poutine uh i uh, yeah i've had poutine i've never had poutine in quebec though poutine here in the u.s they have I, it at like I, the McDonald's uh, there, don't they? Say, yeah, we have it at McDonald's. Thing. Yeah, I don't know. It's I don't like, know anyone that gets it at McDonald's because, like, I don't know. It's it's like if you had a good pizza parlor in Italy and you still went to Domino's. It's kind of like why the right. fuck would you do that? Yeah, like we, yeah. If you want poutine, there's like there's literally a place in my city called the Poutinery, and you can just <laughs> go get poutine there. So it's like, like, a, it's, like a brothel, yeah. the poot palace. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Poutinery. Um, yeah, there, I, I've had poutine a few times. I've never had it from Quebec, though, which apparently is like a sin, but I've never been to Quebec, so I don't know. Uh, is that like the heart of Canada or something? No, that's like... That's just the French that's, Yeah, that's like Yeah, that's French Canada uh, where they like... I, I think that's where poutine originated from and stuff, so... There are like people like in Canada that just completely speak French and like not know English at all. Uh, Usually, well, you usually have to like... If you live in Quebec, you usually have to learn both. I, yeah, uh, I think they're bilingual. Yeah, yeah, they're for sure. bilingual. But like, yeah, I get even here in um, like English Canada, all our packages are French and English, not just oh, really? English. Yeah, like I like in the southern states there, you guys have a lot of like Spanish and English packaging. Mm-hmm. Same idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, we just yeah, like a lot of times you go to like a, if you go like anywhere, you'll see like a warning label and then it'll give you an English and then a Spanish translation. Spanish. Yep. Yeah, yeah. That is, Same that idea is. here, but French. But French is just like silly Spanish, so <laughs> <laughs> kind of yeah. True. It's more <laughs> yeah, this, whole Spanish. There are yeah, some just, like French <laughs> words that are like the exact same word in Spanish. Yeah, just literally said differently, or like a different order. Yeah, it's they're they're pretty fucking similar. If you learn one, you can usually learn the other one pretty damn easily. I yeah. hated French class so much. Dude. Same. You took French. I don't know. Yeah, I don't. I, I was trying to be fucking quirky and random and epic. Mm. Like, and oh, I'm going to be that one guy that knows French out of all my friends. Well, there were a lot of people in the class, so. But I I, I don't know. I, I I would get in random academic moods where I'd be like, I'm going to challenge myself academically. <laughs> yeah, that was the same way, yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, well, fuck this, dude. I'd finally get an F up to a D, and then I'd be like, eh, I don't want to try anymore. Well, I didn't do that. Bad, <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't was fucking stupid. I was just, you know. <laughs> uh, it would just be annoying because it wouldn't be like, fun at all our teacher was a yeah, fucking dude cunt. my dude all my french teachers i don't know what it is about french teachers all of them were fucking dicks growing up i only had one cool one and i'm pretty sure he was an alcoholic and he sings songs about like how to learn french his like artist name is atn and he was one of my high school ATM. teachers atn oh. not not oh. atm atn and he was one of my fucking teachers in high school and he was the only cool one. Um, but the rest were always fucking bitches. They were always yep. so fucking rude for we no reason. We had bathroom so- slips. Like, we had, we can only go to the bathroom, like, twice in her class. What the fuck? Um, every, like, three months. 
Bro. So we, yeah, that was my French teacher. You should have you should have shit your pants what? and revolt. So yeah, if you had to like shit in that class at that particular time of the day, you just shit out of luck. <laughs> yeah, just, if just that was when you had to shit more than twice every three months, then you were fucked. Or had, is, you know, had to go to the bathroom. Yeah, you better, better, better so train your bell cycle, bitch. In my yeah, class, yeah, that is awful. Yeah, and it wasn't fun, dude. It was it was like. You would randomly get called on, like you you wouldn't have to raise your hand or anything. It'd just be like, oh, I okay, now it's classes. your turn. Oh, and yep. now it's your turn, and everyone's just like, I have no fucking clue what's going on. Yeah, <laughs> that's so like, I don't understand. Like, te- some teachers have the mentality that they're like a fucking dictator to their students. Yeah, yeah. it's like just be a person. Like these kids are living their most like stressful age, and you're like treating them like fucking servants. Yeah, you know, let them fucking yep. be themselves yeah it's, well that's it's, just no yeah. way to teach either i mean when you teach like that you, you're not going to get results <clears throat> oh yeah kids no. don't want to listen to people that are overly authoritative the only way to get a kid to learn is like by inspiring them to learn if you're just a fucking bitch and make them dude whenever i would have like a teacher that was just chill and like cool i would it would always make me want to work more i just felt more comfortable like being like class forced almost yeah yeah exactly be like oh yeah i get to go see mr blah 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 whoever today it's like fuck yeah but then there's yeah, always going to be those students who like take advantage of that and just like don't fucking do anything. Dude, Might have the been most me. <laughs> fucking annoying thing to me uh, whenever I was in school is if a teacher was like giving some random example of something and oh, dude, when it was like when it wasn't like a, a core class, so you were like merged with uh, the the dumber students, <laughs> at least for me, like, dude, if, if a teacher had to use something for an example, like so just imagine, like, you put mayonnaise on a sandwich, and you would always have that one dumb motherfucker that's like, I don't like mayonnaise! <laughs> and it's like, that's not the fucking point! <laughs> it's just an example! It doesn't apply to me. I yeah. can't understand this concept. I don't get it because I don't like mayonnaise. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like Toasty Tolerant, so I can't have mayonnaise. Holy dude, it would, I would piss me off so fucking bad, dude. Did you guys have any teachers that were like, like genuinely creepy as fuck. <laughs> uh, I don't think so. Uh, I mean, I think teachers that looked creepy as fuck. I had a teacher that I think had severe <clears throat> Alzheimer's. Oh, that's rough. <clears throat> he he came in and he's just like, well, you know, go buy because I I don't know if you guys have ever purchased. <laughs> well, you know, go buy this. Go buy that. <laughs> he's just hey, a white old dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude oh, I, I, good boy. <laughs> I don't know how expensive books are in Canada, but like college textbooks here are, are like unreal yep, in terms of same just like how expensive they are. But like, yeah, this dude came in and he's just like, well, there is a textbook and like you could buy it. But like, honestly, I would just use it to go to sleep at night. It's pretty boring. You don't really need it. And uh, <laughs> you know what? Legend. To to be honest, I think I, I got like 100 percent in that class because that guy was super cool, you know, to, to like to prove like what McNasty was saying, you know, it was pretty chill. Yeah, uh, yeah. There was a there was a teacher that like Smitty and I had. Um, obviously, we're one year apart, but um, this dude would like let us talk about YouTube and like other forms of media. It was like a media type class, and he'd like let us like think about videos or like let Smitty edit a video in class, and like just not care. And it's just like teachers that just kind of let you do your thing as long as you're like learning about something. It's just I don't know. It's so much better than like super strict. Shitty fucks. Correct. Correct. I think there is a healthy balance though too, because if you're a teacher that just lets your fucking kids run free, a lot of them are going to take advantage of that and end up not doing anything. Oh yeah, you can have structure without it being an asshole. Yeah. Did it's you? Just, uh, yeah. Did you guys ever like see anyone getting a, like a fuck ton of trouble at school? Yeah, uh, I saw a, a couple g- girls get thrown out of a class permanently. <clears throat> there was a they kid just that would got not um, stop talking. There's a kid that got expelled from my school, and he was, like, kind of part of our friend group, but not really. Like, he would come around every once in a while. But he was one of those kids that was, like, like every once in a while you want to hang out with him, but most of the time you're like, God, why is he coming around? Like, it's fucking annoying. Yeah. And he uh, he got kicked out of school. He got expelled for selling fake acid to kids. <laughs> he, he why got, do you even get expelled if it's fake? <laughs> apparently, he came up with, like, a, a tablet paper. Like a paper, you know, like, you know, because you know how when you take acid, it's like little tablets and you yeah. put in your mouth. Well, he had that, but I don't think it had any acid on it. I think it was just a paper. 
Oh yeah, he was yeah, like, you can buy this. He was like selling it to kids, and they were like taking it, and they're just like, yeah, nothing's happening. I think that's why he got reported because like he was selling it to like kids were ex- oh, paying money. I wonder money. what kid was brave enough to to speak up about that. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I bought acid and it didn't work. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's true, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, like you must have been pretty fucking pissed off. <laughs> you could, would tell about that. <laughs> that's probably like the worst thing I've seen. But yeah, that was pretty. Sus burger. There was some fucked ones. I think one of the fucking it was. I don't know. It was funny at the time. It's pretty fucked up now because like this was before like you know school shootings became like a norm. Yeah, so I was. I feel like I was, was the last generation. There's really, really only like you know like happen. the o- old fucked up ones. But this fucking kid, eight a.m. English class. It was completely silent. And he was like five minutes late and he kicked open the door and like pretended to cock like a shotgun just in the air, just went like, and and he just like, he was just joking, obviously, but the teacher fucking freaked out and he got suspended for a month just because he like (laughs) made the shotgun sound. It was so fucked. It was just completely silent at 8 a.m. He just fucking burst the door (laughs) down and does that. It's like, bro, what the fuck was that? Yeah, that one, uh, that one was wild. And then uh, these well, two see, girls... a lot of people hunt here, so people would yeah. have their fucking shotguns and shit in their trucks and, <laughs> Wait, like, shotgun what? shells and... Yeah. Really? <laughs> yeah, I mean, that oh, was just shit. like... It's like, oh, I just went hunting yesterday. Oh, that's so. fucked up. <laughs> but, uh, I was gonna say, two girls at my school once got drunk in the middle of class. Um, they had, like, vodka in... I did that in adult school one time. <laughs> yeah, people would always bring vodka in yeah, a water bottle yeah, like a they, fucking yeah, dumbass. <clears throat> well, they did that, went to a golf course, stole a golf cart, drove it into the side of the school, and got arrested all before lunchtime. <sighs> oh my god. That was, wow, uh, that yeah. sounds awesome. Yeah, that one was fucked, but that fucking was probably it. We weren't allowed to, to drink <laughs> anything drive in golf class. Carts. We, 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 weren't e- we weren't allowed to eat anything in class or drink anything. So, like, there was this one day where this guy uh, had vodka in a water bottle. And, like, the rule already was that you couldn't eat or drink anything, at, even water, in class. Really? So, it was, like, kind of obvious. Because he was the only one drinking out of a water bottle. And it was fucking vodka. It's like, what'd you expect? <laughs> <laughs> the fucking dumbass. Obviously, yeah, you got caught, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no shit. Dude, I just, I never understood that. Like, you gotta be, like, a different level of low to be like, yes, vodka before noon at school. I think you just do that kind of stuff to be cool. I remember the f- I remember I took a one Smirnoff ice in my backpack, <laughs> and me and my friend went in like the like the neighborhood next to my school and like drank it. <laughs> and I thought I was fucking badass drinking a Smirnoff ice with the wow. boys. <laughs> I ate my <laughs> first pot brownie at school. That's the first time I ever got high. Really? Yeah, it was God. completely accidental. I don't know if I've t- have I told this story no, before. No, I don't think you have. I don't think so. Well, my first period class was <clears throat> French one year, my first year of French. And uh, my Mexican friend had brownies. And he's like, you want a brownie? <laughs> and I didn't even know like pot brownies were a thing. And I was like, yeah, man, I'll take a brownie. He's like, okay, I say take the brownie. <laughs> $16. So, well, no, he gave it to me for free. And so I ate it and he was like, you like that brownie? I was like, yeah, it wasn't bad. It's like, there was weed in it, Holmes. <laughs> so, <laughs> I do not taste the weed. You can like... I didn't know. I was just uh, like... I guess, well, if, you don't, I guess if you don't know what it tastes like or smells like. Yeah. Then, yeah you, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> so, yeah, I oh, was... How'd that go? Well, I was really high. <laughs> uh, All of a sudden, I knew perfect <laughs> French. <laughs> <laughs> I was really high, and then I was still pretty high at the end of the day, and that was my first day... Um, practicing baseball with the varsity team, so I was like fucking high at my first baseball practice, and I did so fucking bad. <laughs> yeah, no shit. <laughs> well, that's rough. Yeah, yep. I, I have never accidentally had an edible, and I'm glad for that. Every time it's been like, oh yeah, this is what this is, and you know you can either take it or not. I've never like I feel like everybody. At like especially YouTube parties and shit, it just dude everybody just hands out edible gummies and nobody knows if they're actual gummies. So some of them will just be walking around with a giant bag of gummy bears. You know, like if I eat a handful, am I gonna like sit on the couch and vegetable for like two days or what? Yeah, I got fucking pranked. 
got pranked. Yeah. What? It was <laughs> the edible. Oh, okay. <laughs> the brownie. Okay. I was that like, happens. You know, I feel like, like that I, happens a lot. Like, but I, f- I'm pr- I feel like it's pretty illegal to do that. It is definitely illegal. Without their consent. <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely <laughs> illegal. Tricking people into av- it getting <laughs> drugged? Yeah. Yeah, no, that's that's gotta be... Okay. It's <laughs> <laughs> a gray area thing. Hmm. I don't I mean, think so. The fucking drug is illegal in and of itself. Right. <laughs> well, well, not, where you live now. not in California. Yeah. Well, yeah, it's fucking illegal here still. Is it illegal in Missouri, dude? I don't know. I know it's okay for like medical. I don't know if yeah. altogether though. Is it st- is it like decriminalized where you live, super? Is it still like fully like? Uh, like I heard something that it, about about it being decriminalized up to like a certain amount. Yeah, yeah, or something like That's that. Okay. Which is always it's just so time. fucking weird to me. Like, how can if you have like a little bit of it, it's fine. But if you have more than like if you have like a speck more than what you have then it's illegal like because it becomes the intent of selling right like if they they don't want drug dealers like if you have whatever x amount of you know weed that's obvious personal usage they usually just take it away if it's decriminalized but if you have like 45 pounds of weed in your trunk then you know that's obviously not (laughs) personal usage they they just want someone they they just want it like that because they can't fucking tax it that's why it's fucking illegal (laughs) yeah Mm -hmm. that's why (laughs) Uh, pretty much I'm very glad it's legal in Canada. Like, even when it was illegal, it was just like, hey, stop. No, oh, man, he's not stopping. All right. <laughs> and then they just walk away. Like, literally, like, there was this little, like, town fair that used to always happen. And, like, kids were, like, 16 and walk around, literally walking while hitting a bong. And the police were like, stop doing that or we'll take the bong. <laughs> it's like, <okay. laughs> Cool. I would way rather it be legal. That way, like, you, at least you know what you're getting. Yeah, and that, like, it like, becomes a lot safer. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Because people are going to fucking do it regardless, but... Exactly. I'd rather them know what's in it Yeah, instead uh, of, you know, killing yeah, themselves on The war accident. on drugs is kind of a bullshit show in itself. I feel like all it's done is make <clears throat> any drugs more dangerous. I don't feel like, you know, anybody who I wants to do heroin... just made more drugs, too. Yeah, if anyone who wants to do heroin mm-hmm. is just going to go do heroin, you might as well, you know, I don't want to say sell heroin through the government, but like, you know, people who might die of... <laughs> You know what a sense. Addiction. They want a war on drugs, but not the ones that they sell. Yeah, they might as well tax it. <laughs> like I just, I don't know. Quoting Havoc. Havoc has a, a good song about that. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. It's just, it's confusing. But um, all right, should we end the end the podcast on drugs? <laughs> on drugs. 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 Everyone do drugs. drugs. Don't drugs. Do I mean, if you're cool, you'll do drugs. Yeah. Drugs. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and if you, you don't want to be not respect, cool, then you'll do. <laughs> Your parents don't love you because you don't do drugs. This yeah. is getting age restricted. Mama ain't raised no straight edge. That's coming from me, which is ironic. As fuck. Yeah. Hey, hey, dude. <laughs> hey, dude. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! Are you not high? Oh, you're dead, dude. <laughs> anyway, go sub to Goons Gaming as well. Yeah. 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 Goons Gaming. Yeah. yeah. Goons Gaming. I mean, Okay, uh, yeah, his nasty is it, fading out of existence. Uh, we should end it now uh, before uh, he fades away. Uh, oh, he's coming back. Oh, he's, uh, <laughs> oh, he's back again. All right, Soup, can you do the outro? <laughs> <laughs> Download and speed up for you. And all you go subscribe to the Goon Game. And you like subscribing. Call me on some shit, y'all. Thank you, Chef. You heard the man.